Melon Sandbox keeps having insane updates and things keep getting crazier. Hmm, it's not People Playground, but we got some stuff to destroy. And there are some brand new mods in the game, like this right here. Is this a freaking honeybee? Let's see what happens. Oh, did it make a bee noise? Oh, oh, <laughs> he's getting shot in the butt repeatedly. Bye, bees! Look at him on the ground. Oh, it's just eating away. He, I think he's okay, though, still, right? Is he still fine? I think he might... No, I don't think he's fine. I think he's had some sear... What the heck? This one's crazy. This is the firefly. Uh, I don't know what's gonna happen, but I have to imagine this guy's gonna have some... Pr oh! What happened to him? Whoa, okay. Got some apple juice leaking out of him. Look at that. That's a little intense, I think. Yeah, he's we we're just making some applesauce over here. There's a whole bunch of mods in here. Mini NPC Smurf Cat. What the heck is that? Crane Operator, Sofa, Auto Mechanic, Logger. There's a Shark, Download. We've got a Welder. Hatsune Miku, whatever the heck that is. Uh, it's probably a person by the looks. We got Seek Down. Oh, I gotta watch an ad. Cursed Apple. Oh, yeah, he looks pretty cool down there. I got Ambush, Assassin. There's a tone. What is that? Oh, I downloaded the Nef gun. There's a Nerf gun for whatever reason. We can check that. What is the cursed corn? He looks insane. Well, here it is the Nef gun. <laughs> Let's see what this does. It actually, wait a minute, is actually doing damage to him? How many Nerf bullets does it take to take out a piece of corn? <laughs> I was trying to bring his head in the line, but he started doing a dance. It actually takes quite a few shots from a Nerf gun to take him out. So, oh, whoa! It, okay, right at the end, it actually, it actually got him. That's pretty amazing. We need a apple. We need a pumpkin. We also have the cursed things. Where are those? Here they are. Let's let's see what this looks like. He looks. What the heck is that thing? It looks amazing. It's kind of crazy. To test out this this thing called the wind bomb here. Let's go ahead and put that in the middle of them and see what happens, shall we? Okay, my computer might have died. Oh, okay, what the heck? There's pieces of fruit and vegetables flying everywhere. That didn't quite work the way that I wanted it to, but I think we need to maybe do that again. There you go. You don't need to be alive. You don't need to be alive. You just need to let your parts fly. All right, let's see what happens. We're going to activate it. Let's... Whoa! Um... Well, that definitely worked well. Huh, I also have a shark, which uh, looks like it's pretty derpy. What the heck is even? Will you eat this guy? Yum. Come here. Uh, that's not quite what I had in mind, but it, I guess it's fine. Can he, can he actually open his mouth? He doesn't look like he'll open his mouth. He's just kind of being, he's being really weird. God, what I need to do to damage him. Oh yeah, there we go. That's working we get, i think you I, I think you got him when you plop it down he just kind of looks like oh there he goes He's swimming up to the top <laughs> clearly it's a man in the body of a shark mermaid looking thing because he's even like got legs it looks like and what is he what is he trying to swim I really want to know what the heck this mini NPC, npc smurf thing is it says this is a smurf now, does that mean that it actually does things why is it called smurf cat that's what i want to know maybe because uh, he's got a tail <laughs> maybe he needs to have some kind of weapon attack him like whatever the beetle the beetle is that seems like <laughs> Seems like an appropriate weapon for a little tiny smurf boy. Let's see. I should probably zoom out a little bit. Oh! He's got smurf goo coming out of him. It's all blue. Somehow he's actually extremely resilient. But yeah, he's got... Is he still alive, I think? How are you still alive? I don't know how to control this thing. But we need to get some more smurf... Blue, blued out of there. There we go. <laughs> Get your Smurf blued. These mods are great and all, but 
in all reality, like, they need to function more. They need to do something. We also need another weapon. So let's see what we can find in here. We've, un we've unlocked and almost um, all the weapons. Cursed pumpkin. Download. <laughs> Hard to kill. Smooth hitboxes. Don't know what that means. Strawberries that you can harvest. What are people making fruits for? Okay, here's Seek. Can we put a hat on him? We oh, can totally put a hat on him. How about a dress? There you go. <laughs> There you go. I hope you enjoy. That's great. Oh, there's vehicles and stuff. I didn't even realize there were vehicles. Did I download? What did I download? Oh, yeah. Pumpkins. The pumpkin might... Let's see. What is the pumpkin? Oh, jeez. Okay. He's a big gangly creature thing. We need a, uh, some kind of weapon to use against him. Let's see what we, we got. We've used all of these already. So maybe what we need is something else. Okay. I don't know what this is. It's called the blue pistol. So we'll see. Nothing's, nothing's happening. There's nothing coming out of that thing. All right, I don't think I've ever seen uh, what happens when you do death by paintball. So let's give it a shot, I guess. And oh, how many paintball shots does it take to actually take them out? Let's move it a little bit. There we go. And paintball shot to the face. Oh no, yeah, he's getting all colored and stuff. He's somehow still alive okay i think maybe a laser gun will work better maybe not though doesn't uh really seem to be doing a whole what the heck has happened oh you just hold it on him yeah does that feel good you need a dent you need a dental operation i can help you how is he withstanding this laser to his eyeball there might be more mods but we have to wait 17 hours to find out there could be a lot more things you, you know we need heavy firepower i just want to know now if he's actually able to be destroyed or if it's like you know he's impervious to damage or something so here we go in three two one oh yeah um I, I don't think he's uh, impervious to damage. Here's this dress. See, this crane operator, is he like in a whole big thing or is he is he by himself? He's not in here. So maybe he's like actually in a thing by I don't know I don't know where we can how we can find him. Oh here he is. He was like here the whole time. Oh he's not actually in a crane. He's just kind of by himself. He's just been dressed up. That's all it is. It's just the apple. And close. Guess we can always test out what happens when you drop a couch on somebody. Ha! <laughs> he gets crushed, but he's still alive. It's not enough. That worked. That that was a little bit better. The uh, apple was turned into some red cranberry applesauce. He is no more. And so yeah, all in all, you know the mods are pretty cool and stuff, but they they're just like kind of reskin stuff. There doesn't seem to be anything. Too amazing although there is some new stuff with like the bee and whatnot that's kind of cool but they're definitely we definitely need some more things that we can get a plague doctor like he let's download this guy oh he he doesn't actually have anything by himself he just kind of is a, a normal guy uh he did have like a maybe it was a spear or something you need this spear Oh no! That wasn't what was supposed to happen, but I mean, it's okay. How about the pumpkin? Can we. Oh, jeez. Skewered him right in the booty. Yeah, well, it's, it's interesting to say the least. Oh, there are new mods in Melon Playground. And. <laughs> What is that thing? And today we're gonna cause all kinds of different chaos and destruction. It's gonna be good. Look at this. You can vote for items. People want what? canned tomato. Apparently, this vacuum cleaner was added. And so, of course, what I need to do is test and see if we can suck this apple's head off. Huh? So, first things first, let's go ahead and act. Oh, <laughs> Yeah, it totally I sucked off his leaf thing. So he kind of works, but are we able to actually Suck off the whole thing. I don't I don't know actually can we make this thing more powerful doesn't look like I can I'm very sad Anyway, we got some new mods here and the first thing I saw was some kind of giant troll thing He has some kind of he's got like a weapon of some kind, but right here. He doesn't look at him He says he's an NPC, but uh does he do anything? Maybe I can activate him. 
He doesn't, nothing happens when I activate him, okay? He's just kind of a normal guy, I, I guess. Although he does have a huge fist, which should make uh, this pretty fun. Boom! Oh, no! Boom! Ooh! That was a little bit more intense than I thought. I think the melon guy is still alive. Oh, this thing right here is called the contraption spawner. It's a brand new too. And uh, this may or may not be. <laughs> it did it. It's a Dunkleotosis. I don't know. It spawned it in. All you have to do is click on it, click the save file, and then you can spawn whatever you got selected oh, look at this guy he's pretty cool looking little robot fighting dude yeah yeah look at me he's actually pretty cool whoa look at this gypsy dangers here but <laughs> gypsy danger has got his sword its sword which uh, is blue and he's not nearly as tall as he should be and gypsy danger doesn't like melons oh 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 that was a close one. Let's try it again, shall we? Oh, there we go. Right in the melon booty. Yep, give me that watermelon juice. And a kick. <laughs> yeah, he's still alive somehow. So, it's a little bit of a... Uh, I, I don't know. I'm a little disappointed because it shows there's a light and stuff. But clearly... He doesn't light up. There's no activation buttons except for on his hands it activates, but then there's obviously nothing there. Oh, jeez. There's nothing that happens. So, uh, needless to say, Gypsy Danger's a little bit disappointing to say the least. He lost a leg. At least he's leaking oil. Let's see what other mods we have. Stalker. We've seen that apple. Shadow the ninja. Okay, we've seen that. Scorpion. Ooh, garage cans. Yeah, let's download that. We'll download Scorpion. We got the plague die. Do we see him already? I think we did. Get this elite knight over here. Hairdresser. That's what's his face. Auto mechanic. New gen. Okay, let's see that. PC. Is that PC, man? Vandal. What? Huta? Graffiti, man. We've all. Okay, we've seen these ones before. Uh, I've got some ideas. Alright, here we go. We got a pile of apples. <laughs> and, uh, above it, we have a new item. Let's see what happens when we drop it. Oh, okay. It didn't quite do what I wanted to do. So I think we need some more garbage cans. Okay, here we go. More apples. And here comes slow motion. Oh, yeah! <laughs> I'd say that that one worked a little bit better. We need more. Let's just mix it up, actually. Instead of garbage cans, let's use APCs. <laughs> oh, jeez. We just made applesauce, and it's delicious. Look at PC Man. Does he do anything? No, he just kind of stands here, too. Oh, oh, whoa, what the... Where did you get that freaking bazooka? I was... I, I'm, I'm, I'm a little confused right now because I brought this out to hit him with it. But somehow he grabbed it from w way far away. Wait, what the... What the heck? He's got magic powers. Actually, you know what? This, that's, this is perfect. <laughs> it's pointed right at himself. Hold on, let's... Let's just go ahead and bring it out in front of him and activate. Oh, <laughs> he's lost. Where's this little PC head gone? Windows 95 or whatever. Come back. There it is. Little. Whoa, it's just a bunch of circuit boards now. All right. And here's Scorpion. Do you have any abilities or anything? None of them have any abilities. I don't think that's how it works in this game. But he does have a fist, which is always good to break. So, oh no, something bad happened to his hand. Okay, uh, get, apparently he's not able to destroy melons that well. Hey, yeah, one, one inch punch, just straight up rip that watermelon in half. This golden dude is the elite knight and he hates apples. So he's got this spear and he's got this apple and he got him. Yeah. Oh, juicy. Just slid right down the spear pole. All right. Okay. Go ahead and take a bite. Take a bite of him. You know you want to. Oh, what the heck is happening? Oh, you want to make a little apple souffle with the laser. Get a, First thing you got to do is cook it up and get it nice and 
crispy. What the heck are you even doing, man? Then once it's nice and golden brown, there we go. That's, that's how you do it. I didn't know apples had bones inside. The cool thing is, I mean, they look amazing and stuff, but they don't actually activate or do anything. Like this guy doesn't do anything. But this does. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. Right in his. Oh, is that his helmet? Wait, that that really destroyed that destroyed him. I'm very surprised by this. Hold on a second. We got. Uh, I'm gonna put a bunch of fireworks down like this. Okay, let's make a nice little line of them. All right, and then what I think we should do is we got the plague doctor who probably doesn't do anything either. So actually, he's just a he's just a green guy. So what I think we'll do is we'll go ahead and get ourselves a nice little. No, you need to do the the leg the leg ground thing. There we go. That's what we are looking for. Then what we'll do is we'll we're gonna activate. I don't know how to rotate these things properly. There we go. Okay, we're gonna activate them. Activate them all. I I think this will work. You know, he's holding that one. No big deal. And let's play it. And yeah. <laughs> There we go. I should have slow motioned it. I kind of want to do that again. Here we go. I've constructed this nice little <laughs> box of death. Let's go ahead and see what happens here. I think this should be uh, quite enjoyable to see some applesauce being made. Maybe. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> it even it got me because I wasn't expecting it like to go off. I thought it like it had freaked out. Dude, it blew the bricks apart. It did make applesauce. Did you see that? But that was beyond what I expected to happen just then. That freaking startled me. Well, just like People Playground, uh, this freaking game is just as fun. I wish that these things could like have their own abilities though. Loki. What the heck? The Loki's over here. We got to hope. Uh, and also, like, I can't refresh it. I saw other people being able to refresh, but I can't. Oh, there's the shark. The shark's freaking awesome. Uh, yeah, well, I mean, there's also saves, too. Let's look at the saves real fast. We, is there any? Whoa, a tree monster. Indestructible. Very optimized for weak Oh, Wait, wait, okay. He's just some kind of tree monster. We got a Dunkleotusis. We got a P-51. Can that thing fly? All right. Here it is. Looks pretty cool. Um, how the heck does this thing fly? What button do we have? I mean, do we have to press? Maybe we press the, the this thing in the front here, or maybe this thing in the back. I don't actually know. I don't know what I those bombs. Those might be bombs, right? Those are bombs. Oh, he's going. We got liftoff. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, we had lift off, but uh, uh, needless to say, there's a problem with it. Hey Apple, Melon Playground's got some new mods, wanna see? This is a shark gun? What the heck? Let's see what this does, shall we? Whoa, 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 Apple, your body disappeared. We'll experiment more with the shark gun, but first let's see what other mods there are. Oh yeah, there's a crocodile. We got buff melons. We've seen the honey gun, but what the heck is the nether tar? Uh -huh. Oh, I'm downloading that. Oh, little pumpkin ducks. That's gonna be fun. Cat gun. Wait, what the heck? Hello, Mr. Pumpkin. Would you like to meet Mr. <laughs> Crocodile? Oh, no. Does this thing work? Why is he invisible all of a sudden? I don't understand. The game is a little wonky sometimes. Go right there. Right there. Put your head right there. Yeah, get it in. We can totally get it in there, maybe. We're gonna have to take a running start. <laughs> Look at him. Here we go. Yeah. Oh, okay. One more try. Yeah. Oh, we missed. Hold on. Let's try it again. Pumpkin juice. Oh, effective. It looks as though the crocodile has eaten the pumpkin head. I didn't know crocodiles like pumpkins. Let's go ahead and clear the battlefield real fast. Uh, there we go. Nothing quite like a nuclear bomb to take care of your problem. The crocodile is gone, but somehow some of the pumpkin remains. I I'm... 
I, I don't think that that's very practical at all. Where and where is there a crocodile? Nope, the crocodile is actually gone. Let's go ahead and grab our melon boy here. Look at him looking all juicy today. And here is the cat gun. What the heck could the cat gun possibly do? Let's find out. Uh, activate. Whoa, oh, okay. Hold on. We gotta move that. We gotta move the cat down a little bit. We need to get close to his little juicy belly. Oh, the watermelon liquids are coming out of him. It's okay, little watermelon. He's still. You see that? He's fine. He's not. He's nothing wrong with him. He's all right. Nope. Never mind. You know, now that he's like this, we need to get some watermelon pieces. So let's go ahead and uh, there should be a nice specific explosive thing. That where is it? It's not in there. Here it is. The wind bomb. Let's go ahead. Oh, jeez. I'm sorry. Hold on one second. I'll take care of that. It'll be all right. And whoa, what was that? It just like popped. Uh, wait a minute. We need another one of those. I need to see what that just was. Okay, bring it on over. We're going to put it right on. No, put it right on top of them. There we go. And activate. Boom. Oh, jeez. It like shot it out to the side or something. I mean, here we go. This is where we need it to be right here and there like that. Now activate it. See? Comes out the Oh jeez. This is nuts. You know what I've really wondered since this since we started playing this game? Can this corn guy can he actually pop? Is there a flamethrower? Oh yeah, there's a flamethrower. Can you pop? Let's see. I need to let's freeze him in place. Let's lower this a little bit. There we go, and let's activate it now and see what happens. Yeah, there you go. Dude, he does pop! Look at him popping! No way! He's actually popping popcorn! <laughs> That's amazing! Oh, this game. Oh, now we got burnt popcorn. Burnt popcorn's gross. Alright, here's our melon boy, and here's the shark gun. It's time to find out what happens if we oh well, oh geez whoa that is incredibly really in, intense that it does like a little weird whoa did you see the kickback on that thing look at the kickback on that gun boom shark weapon is insane look at what's happened to him whoa <laughs> you can just go nuts with them wow all we have left is the gross little white part of the watermelon that nobody likes to eat. Let's see, we also have a couple other things. Did we see the gorilla already? I don't actually know if we saw this gorilla. We might have saw the gorilla. Do we see the Mayan warrior? I don't know if we saw him. Do we see the grunt? What are these things? I downloaded these? <laughs> Apparently I did. Oh yeah, we also have that guy. Oh, wait, let's see. Where are those little... Where are the little tiny things that we downloaded? They're like little baby pumpkin ducks and things. Where are those at? Oh, here they are, little pumpkin duck and a melon duck. Okay, wait, can we actually... Oh, you know what we need to do? We need to give these guys a weapon. How about you, uh, Mayan sword, Mayan guy can have this epic looking staff here. Wait, how do I get him to hold it? Well, he grabbed it, uh, but he lost his arm in the process. <laughs> how, about, how about we try with the gorilla? I don't know why that just happened, but it did. There he goes. Yeah, that's not quite how I want you to hold it, but it should work nonetheless. Oh, what the heck? What happened? Why is that a result? Oh, it's a result of this staff. I was like, why did that just occur? Are these ducks super powerful? Let's check out the nether tour. Oh, yo, he looks insane. Uh, you want to eat a rag now today? Oh, he's actually like not that much bigger than him, but come here. You're going to get in his mouth. Eat him. Yeah. Oh, oh, that's a little weird looking, but how about a punch? Oh, jeez. Okay, that works. <laughs> we should, uh, oh, gee. Oh, no, the watermelon's, uh, he's mangled. What is a push grenade? Let's see what this thing is. Uh, what's going to happen? Oh, okay. It just <laughs> just threw him across the level, apparently. Whoa, 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 wait. It's like the Nora uh, uh, Spider-Man dude. Look at him. Looks amazing. He's all black. I like the way he looks. He looks cool. What would you call this? Some kind of black, I don't know, rotten fruit of some kind. He doesn't look like... Does he have any powers or anything? He doesn't have any ability. What was that? 
Why did he just flex his butt like that? You see that? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Wait, do we see what the Monroe bomb does? I don't even. Whoa, it's glowing already. What does this do? Can I follow him? Hold on. Yeah, I can't follow him. Okay, follow him and activate this, though. So. Here we go. What the heck? These are his arms. We've got little uh, bones left over here. What was. What was that? <laughs> I don't even know what it, I don't even know what just happened. Just turns bl the world turns blue. Ooh, we got to see this again. Zoom it out a little bit. Let's try it again. Wow, that is an incredibly insane explosion. Something called the FBI Dora. Uh, okay, like Dora the. Ex Why does she have pink hair? <laughs> what the heck? <laughs> I don't know. Dora, what would you do if you were walking down the street? and you encountered a crocodile, just randomly. Now, I don't know, in the streets of New York or something. Which weapon would you select? <laughs> cup thrower, wait, what the heck? What is a cup thrower? What does it, hold on, let me pause it. What does a cup thrower do? Wait, just do the thing. It's literally, is it literally throwing cups? <laughs> Is it? It's just cups? <laughs> I'm so confused. Hold on, let's shoot a cup at Dora. All right, let's. Let's see, yeah, they're shooting cups at this little watermelon FBI agent. Oh, railgun, good choice. That's gonna definitely uh, take care of this crocodile. Oh, man, what the crocodile can actually be destroyed? Whoa, this railgun is like super powerful. Can we actually like blast this watermelon crocodile in half, dude? This is. This is beyond- I didn't actually think that this would happen. She needs more firepower. Yeah, grenade launcher. You might want to take a step back. Yeah, I warned you. I tried to warn you. Ooh, Melon Playground's got some- What is that thing? Got some new mods. We got Huggy. Got that crazy thing. Alien. Whatever the what? face. Oh my, what is that thing? We got faces. Myers. Okay, with that thing. Mommy Long, look at all this stuff. Oh my goodness. Headless right. Oh, it's a Halloween update for sure. Skeleton, witch, SCP stuff. Look at all this. This is insane. I might have to make two videos on this, maybe. I have downloaded everything. Look, there's a cactus guy. Wait, what the heck? Where'd you come from, Mr. Cactus Guy? You need to uh, you need to have some problems. Cause you are facing uh, the alien. <laughs> Look at him. Can he move? Oh, he totally can. Let him say hi. Let him infect you. Can an alien infect a cactus thing? I don't know. Does it matter? It doesn't matter. Oh, look at his little... His little fruits popped off his head. You hungry, little alien? There you go. I don't like how alien is like one color. It's just like really weird green color. And what is this black dot? Just a normal guy going for a walk until... Oh my, what is that thing? Where do you think you're going, buddy? Oh look, he's absolutely terrified. What is this creature? Ooh, he's got eyes all over him. Big gangly hands. Let me touch your face with them. Then I don't even know what you call you'd call these things. Are they supposed to be legs? I thought he could. Uh, oh, jeez, we're getting melon juices everywhere. He's somehow able. Oh, jeez. Okay. Uh, this uh, had a problem. Don't worry. The watermelon boy is totally fine. <laughs> I don't know what this is. Melon thing? We're gonna check that out at the end of the video. Oh, look, it's Huggy. He's very tall. His legs work. He's hairy like he should be. And he's got a fist. But you like that? How do you like that? Those apples, Huggy? Not too terrifying. Hey, boom! Oh, no! Something happened to Apple Man. I think he's still alive. Sort of. But, uh, oh, Huggy, don't sit on him. Don't need to rub it in. How about a butt bomb? Oh no! Huggy! <laughs> um, Huggy's having problems. Oh, here's Mommy Longlegs. Didn't she look like she had crazier, like a crazier body going on in this? I think so, let me look. Oh, she's just all crazy, scraggly, sitting there. She does have the big old, like, you know, hip. Look at, it. Look at me dance. Watch me dance, Huggy. Whoa! Look at the headless rider. Normally pumpkin here. 
would be terrified of the headless rider but pumpkin has a secret weapon haha <laughs> look at this it's called the ghost gun let's see what it does shall we don't go anywhere headless boy we gotta find out what the did you hear that <laughs> that's hilarious what he just got utterly obliterated what is this weapon michael myers normally it'd be terrified but not with the ghost gun let's start with the legs oh no corn just destroyed himself get out of here we don't need you anyway dude how did he going to do that it completely disintegrates his legs all that's left are little bones <laughs> what the heck okay let's try it again maybe we're gonna do the whole body you totally can what in the this is the most powerful gun in the game oh man the pumpkin king is amazing <laughs> look at his big purple suit he's going to church right now look at this big crazy arm thing what is i think they're supposed to be like a branch or something he's literally in pajamas or something or like a a track suit <laughs> let's see if oh it has a point on it can it like actually skewer the the watermelon oh i don't think so what if we try like this let's freeze the game let's freeze that spot and then let's take watermelon's head and go nope uh -huh. uh -huh. nope how about as far as we can oh no watermelon what happened dude what is the pumpkin king he's okay he's just like a giant jack-o-lantern and then a interesting body now, i do like the little you know hand things hey you're pretty cool you know what's worse than a giant jack-o-lantern pumpkin insane thing uh that thing with a gigantic battle axe <laughs> hey cactus and got something for you how about that and we chop you up into pieces and we eat you for dinner people eat cactuses did you know that i didn't i didn't really know that but people do eat cactuses certain cactuses like prickly pears or whatever i knew baloo does do you know the song <laughs> you better oh no the cactus's head fell off that's never a good thing uh he doesn't know how to really hold the axe i'll help you that's this is how you do it right here you do it like this this is the way now we got pumpkins so jack o oh he just do you see him burst oh it's a dark trooper you know what makes a dark trooper not as scary <laughs> when he's carrying a big honey bee gun look at <laughs> how, how ridiculous is that how ridiculous is this scene we got a we got a dark trooper over here who's very terrifying to do a lot of damage and then he's got a bee gun yeah yeah it seems about right Ooh. The bees like the corn. Oh, he's still alive somehow? Wow, I didn't know that. I didn't know you could survive that many <coughs> bees. Yeah. Tear oh, we can hold it down. We're gonna make popcorn here in a second. Uh, uh, it didn't work. But we can, I think. Can we ignite him? Where is it? Ignite. Let us make popcorn. Could I have done this before to make popcorn? Oh, I totally could. Making a popcorn. I'm hungry. Dark Trooper likes them. Uh, barely any popcorn. You burnt it. You like it burnt though, don't you, you sick weirdo? It's time. We need the melon. Oh. Uh, what? What the heck? What happened to him? He just... Yo! What is occurring? Why is he turning into a skeleton? Okay, he's fine. Now, mel melon, you need to see what happens when you get mutated. Here it is melon thing oh oh my look at it what the heck is this nightmare ha ah, melon look something happened to you oh he's got crazy like claw things he's got whatever this dude he's been infected by alien alien just bursting out of him over here then he's got this crazy it's like a crocodile head Dude, are these official are these official mods from the dev or from people if they're from people and somebody made these things it's kind of amazing okay dude oh dude what the heck you can't can't skewer dude with that thing how about his foot nope his foot just broke clean off how about his head let's try his with his head you're gonna eat him he's eating him 
He's eating him. Yeah, yeah. Devour him. Okay, you can't can't even eat him either. But he is. <laughs> you can't. You can't do it. Maybe if we freeze it. Does he like infect the game? He made apple melon. Okay, he, just a melon guy for some reason. Doesn't like his like old self or whatever. Okay, so first of all, here's what we need to do. We need to get this guy in position. <laughs> get this guy in a position there. Yeah, this doesn't look weird or anything. <laughs> yeah, nice job, dude. <laughs> yes, the uh, position has been assumed. Now it's time for pumpkin head smashing. Oh no, you missed. Try it again. Oh jeez. Okay, try. It. We, we're going for the head. Oh no. Oh, he won't. He won't get in. Get in there. How about an arm? Let's try. Actually, a leg. There you go. Foot time. Okay. Nope. Can't get a foot in there. How about we try it one more time? Nope. It won't work. If you didn't see, Melon Playground had a crazy mod update with tons of Halloween stuff. Like, look at this creature. What is that thing? And in the last video, we checked out a lot of them, but there's still some we still need to look at. So that's what we're doing today. This thing right here is a hideous monster that we discovered last time. It's called the melon thing. It is literally a watermelon. You can see his face right here. This is ice ball. He's been mutated in some kind of hideous alien creature is growing out of his face and his stomach and uh he's quite terrifying also there's a cactus which which got fruits on him which you can actually knock off if you hit him hard enough hold on let me just try to do that right now there we go oh uh, well i might have broke the melon thing but did i knock any yeah look there's the fruits right there aren't they delicious looking we didn't look at the jacko creature last time so let's look at him now oh man he is hideous looking oh look at those fingers come hither let me touch your face real fast don't you like the way that i touch you but now no well he's okay oh look he lost his leaf where did it go these are some creepy looking gangly fingers though that is for sure Ugh, you're punching right in, right in the apple face yeah i just made some look Look, Ma, I made apple crisp. Hey, look, it's a skeleton. He's pretty cool looking, actually. And if you didn't see, this is the ghost gun, which is the most powerful weapon this game has ever seen. And to demonstrate the power of the ghost gun, I have lined up all of our favorite fruits and vegetables here. Also, uh, cactus? What technically is a cactus? Just a plant and it grows fruits, right? It's not a fruit or a cat. It's, yeah, I think that's the case. It's a plant. Anyway, uh, watch and behold the insanity of this thing. Boom! <laughs> oh! I didn't know it was gonna do that. I actually am very shocked at this. Uh, but as you can see, and here, <laughs> it's shooting ghosts and they're very powerful. I actually am curious to know is there a limit to the destruction of that ghost gun? Gotta clear out all this stuff on the ground over here. We need to get in some new people. There we go. And uh, yep. If they step on anything, they literally like break their legs. No, don't do it. You're gonna knock the whole group over. It's like a weird thing of dominoes over here. Stand right on that fruit. There you go. We're just gonna get a whole bunch of them. It's like one of those weird videos where you're lining up tons of people just to see. Wow, it's lagging. I don't think I've ever had this happen before. Here we go. Three, two, one. What? <laughs> it went through all of them. Dude, the ghost gun is obscene. It's just, this is how you clean up the game. You don't need to click get rid of all living. You just need to do this. Wow, you are a dangerous skeleton. It's doing it again. When you put the melon down, he gets all bony. I don't know why. So let's try it with the pumpkin. Pumpkin man. Oh, this is kind of creepy. Just came out of nowhere. Uh, this is, uh, yep, an evil guy. Look at him. Dressed in his little evil outfit. Uh, I have one, you know, he's just a watermelon. But I do have one uh, thought here. And it's really just to see, uh, is it capable uh, of, is his head capable of being kind of pokey and <laughs> don't do weird things right now you just need to stand there like that and then we're gonna raise this up like that there we go <laughs> and freeze it okay now the goal here is to see if these little horns here can skewer him no oh no it just goes right through how about his tail 
Oh no, his tail's invisible. Oh, oh, oh no! What the heck happened? <laughs> well, uh, it wasn't anything too extreme, but uh, we just made it, so there you go. Pumpkin juice, apple juice, watermelon juice for everybody. Normally, this corn witch here might make somebody kind of scared, but uh, <laughs> when it's facing off against a buff giant melon <laughs> with a huge bat in its head, He's not too scared, actually. I don't know what's going to happen. Oh, gee. Oh, you're su survives? Did you have a, you have a cape on? He? Oh, I mean, it's a witch, so technically it's probably a girl. Uh, how are you? Oh, yeah, that, that might have worked. Dude, it's still standing? And the buff melon's been knocked out. What in the heck? How are you still standing? See how you do with the cat gun, though. Remember the cat gun? Oh, what the heck? Why is it freaking out like that? Jeez, I didn't realize it was that extreme, uh, but it is. Oh, no. Corn juice? Oh, it's corn syrup. We got corn syrup just coming out of this witch. Completely destroyed. Wow. Oh, my goodness. Look at this. It's Gorgon. Look at Gorgon. The backwards knees. Oh, look at the claws on this thing. Oh, yeah, that's not creepy or anything. Also, can it eat stuff? We need to see if it can eat him. Uh, hold on one second. First of all, can the claws actually do anything? Nope, just kind of touching them. Yep, that's- that's- This is exactly how Gorgons attack. Right here. <laughs> yeah! We don't need that arm. Get out of here. Oh, jeez. Okay, how about- can you eat him? Yum! Yum! Oh, he's definitely trying to eat him. Not working out too well, but... Man! Uh... Gorgon's intense. He's got what are his what are his toes what are his toes like? You like the toes? You like the foot? <laughs> Things are getting weird and uh, it's getting weird. Here's a melon and here's a pumpkin. Oh man, <laughs> the jack o' lantern didn't like crush him at all. That's very disappointing. Oh, that worked out. Watermelon juices for everybody. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, that's good. You know what's worse than backrooms faces? Backroom's faces with the flamethrower, especially when facing off against the corn. Because corn doesn't want to become popcorn, but that's exactly what's about to happen. Let's see how this goes. Oh, oh, yeah. Don't burn it. Don't burn the popcorn, you weirdo. Just leave it normally. There we go. Yep, right in the booty. Make sure that gets airy, gets toasted, and we're good. Good job. You did it. How you feel? You ready for some food? Some popcorn? Do you even like popcorn? Hi, Mr. Cactus. Or is it a girl? I don't know. You know what? Jason is pretty creepy. Jason likes himself some uh, prickly pear fruit. And he's just gonna grab a little bit of it. Oh, a gentle little tap there. Oh, no! Okay. What is, uh, what kind of juices does a cactus leave? Just water, right? Oh, oh. He wants to... There he goes. He got the fruit. Okay, open up, Jason. There you go. Are you hungry? You want some more? Give me the... Give it. Give it. Oh, jeez. It's getting a little violent. Hold on. Come back over here. Come here. He just wants to say hi. No big deal. Oh, right in the butt. Oh, no. Right in the butt. Yum. Oh, jeez. Okay. Got, he's got one fruit left. Get the fruit off of there. Yeah, there you go. Now you got it. Here. Eat. Eat. Eat it! <laughs> Look at it. It's a CSGO guy. He, normally, you know, he's not scared of anything because he fights terrorists all day. Oh, yeah, we're fighting the terrorists. <laughs> but uh, today's a little different because he's facing off against SCP. Oh, no. Ah. Look at these claws. Sorry, it's not SCP. It's SCP-96. You know what I'm saying. Anyway, here we go. And... <laughs> You know what he needs? Oh, look at him jumping on him. Oh, oh, what's happening? This how you fight right now? Dun 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 dun. I wish that the- oh, it kind of did actually interact- Wow! That's just brutal! Lem- uh, it doesn't matter what watermelon looks like, he still leaves the watermelon juices. Oh, jeez, what just happened? Is he gonna eat him? Eat him. <laughs> the water this game is uh definitely you know kind of like plain but it's fun is that all of them i actually think that might have been all the new halloween things by the looks of it i think so yeah maybe okay i don't know which one's my 
which one I like the most from this video. We got the crazy Halloween guy. Okay, we've got uh, we got the eyeball guy. Let's look at them all. let's look at them all. Eyeball guy together. Uh, we got the yeah jackal creature. Oh no, jackal creature. Oh, <laughs> he's having problems. <laughs> we got uh, where's the other one? We got the melon thing. Oh, the melon thing's got to be the best one, right, guys? Vote comment below which one you like the most. SCP-96. Hmm, the faces. I think, I mean, oh yeah, and Gorgon. Oh yeah, Gorgon's pretty cool. I think out of all of them, like here, here you go. Vote on these ones. Which one's your favorite? I think I like the melon thing the most. And then probably the Jacko creepy dude. And then maybe Gorgon. And then faces. No, SCP. Then faces. Then the eyeball guy. He's weird. He's got weird legs. Looks like weird. looks like a bird. <laughs> oh, looks like Melon Playground's got some new juicy looking mods. That is a carrot monster. There's a ghost. Look at that. It's Jocker. <laughs> Look at how good it looks though. What is 2027? the virus melon that looks insanely amazing hey look mr cactus it's your brother uh this one isn't though whoa he's got teeth in a circle on his head that seems and what the heck happened to all of his body oh he's got that flesh eating bacteria thing that's going around you want to you want to learn the hard way what happens with it huh huh Look at him. He's punching. Oh, he just popped his fruit. Can you eat? Can you eat his head? Eat his head. Yeah. Oh, he ate his fruit. Dude, dude, I didn't know that would happen. Straight up ate his fruit. Oh, no. What's happening? Oh, that's not good. Whoa, there's something called the atom gun. All right, here it is. It's just a little tiny thing. Oh, can it actually be that deadly? Here we go. Let's test in three, two, one. Okay, what happened? He just... Uh, I mean, he's a he's, his core has been exposed. Kind of has a really cool sound to it. Listen. Oh, what the? It just turned into applesauce. Oh, wait. Oh. <gasps> Oh, oh my goodness what just happened he's just a core of apple parts what happens to the cactus guy i don't know if i've actually done this yet let's see you do wait is there a pumpkin guy hold on oh my i can't even control this thingy thing ah or not yo don't i'm it won't let me hold it down and shoot it real fast okay well that's weird kind of lame sauce <laughs> yeah, okay, that's apparently what's inside a cactus right there. Mr. Melon, you can meet Mr. Ghost. Let's see. Oh, it, oh, it floats. What the? That's amazing. Hey, you want to touch it? Go ahead, give it a touch. Ah, just kidding. You got scared, didn't you? No, I didn't. Look at him. <laughs> Look at him. Oh, yeah. He always doing the dance thing again. There we go. Okay, let's see what happens when the ghost comes and attacks you let's see if we can oh oh whoa what what's happening look at the ghost is drip is dripping white goo it's like a marshmallow everything's turning white that's kind of amazing yeah oh my look at how well done this joker is i am so surprised wow some people just want to watch the world burn or hit themselves in their own head. I need to find out. Oh, what is this creature? 2027. Is there a pumpkin guy? There is a pumpkin guy. Pumpkin guy. Meet this guy. What the heck is this? Oh, he has arms. Oh, why does he have like an elephant face? No, trunk thing. Oh, dude, run for your life. He's going to eat you or something. Whoa, are those his legs? Whoa, he's got giant legs. Oh, don't touch him. Keep your hands off. Keep your weird trunk off of him. He doesn't want to be touched by you. Oh, here it comes. Here it comes. Drop the people's elbow. <laughs> the people's elbow. Oh, my gosh. It's been a long time since I heard that one. Boom. Oh, whatever this whatever this thing is, it, 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 it drips gray. And it can get all red, the red goo stuff. You know what I'm saying? Why is he turning red if he turn if he drips some gray stuff? I'm a little confused. Oh my 
goodness, Mr. Corn. You're about to meet the most terrifying creature known to man. It's the carrot monster. Oh my goodness. Look at this grotesque thing. Oh, no, just run away. Oh, look at his weird legs. Oh no, he's even, it's even worse because he doesn't have any arms. Can you eat him? Let's see. Open up your gullet hole. Actually, his mouth is like a, gets together. But he can't, can he actually eat him? Uh, he, he, oh, look at him, look at him trying. Corn, he likes himself some corn for dinner. Mmm, whoa, this is getting weird over here. Down, down, down. He kinda has like a rabbit face to him. The, oh, ho, 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 ho. the headless carrot. Isn't it juicy? Carrot juice, you know? Oh, jeez. I'm gonna mount it on my wall. Hold on one second. There we go. What the? I downloaded the hedgehog. <laughs> what? Whoa, look at him. <laughs> he's, he's, oh, whoa, his... Wait, you can't flip over? His butt weighs like a thousand pounds or something. He literally is... Hey, you can't break the physics and gravity of this thing. Listen up, uh, Mr. Hedgehog. How would you like to be squashed by Venus? Because uh, <laughs> that's about what's going to happen right now. Actually, I don't... Usually when we drop things, they don't work. So let's, let's see what happens here. Oh! It worked. All right. What is the virus melon? Uh, my game literally started, like, messing up. And I thought it was because of this thing. I thought it was a legitimate virus. But it's not. Oh, oh, okay, here's a regular melon, boom, okay, here's a buff melon, oh, boom, look, I love the buff melon, he's so ridiculous, uh, and here is the virus melon, oh no, oh, don't, oh, oh, don't get infected, guys, don't let him touch you, or don't let his face eat you, oh, no, he is, he is weird, what? Where's his face? What even, what even is he? I'm so confused right now. Is he supposed to point this way? Yeah, that's his feet, I think. But he does have a weird, like, backside thing going on. Uh, I am very, like, creeped out by this thing, to say the least. I don't quite know what is even happening, but it is. Oh, yeah, do we have an- I have another- oh, I have another weapon. Have we seen this thing before? It's called the Firefly. I don't actually know. Let's see what happens. Whoa, what in the... What is happening? Is it shooting like five bullets on... It's lagging. Wait, have we seen this before? I'm holding it down. We might have seen this before. No, is this the one that can go through like multiple things? Or is that the, the ghost one? The ghost gun. That might be the ghost gun. Let me see. Oh yeah, that's the ghost gun. It's like hyper powerful. And it just disintegrates things. Except for apparently... Skulls of melons, which is kind of a weird thing to say. Uh, okay, there we go. All that's left is two toe, two fingers. You need to have a vote right now. Comment below. You tell me which thing is the most like horrific looking thing. The virus melon. Uh, maybe the melon thing, which I think is still probably my favorite. Or uh, the carrot dude, who is uh, that face is just nightmare level. Or elephant nose boy, which I don't know what we want to call him. He's weird. The Pumpkin King? I'm just gonna sit, you know, I'm just bringing him here. He's not really crazy looking. He, he looks more like he's going to church, but with a purple outfit, you know what I'm saying? Uh, and then this guy. Uh, so, I don't know. Let me know your thoughts, because honestly, this is hard. I think Melon Thing is probably my favorite. He's definitely the creepiest. Uh, but then the freaking carrot weirdo takes takes a close second. He he he's so upsetting to me. I think we need to destroy everybody. Okay, here we go. That uh, should take care of them, I think. And let's just go ahead and obliterate them and get rid of them, so then we don't have to look at them anymore. And I think they're gone, right? Yep, body parts flying everywhere. Uh, let's just make sure that nobody's left. What is this? The pumpkin guy somehow is still alive. He's not even on fire, really. I'm very confused. At least the carrot guy's gone. That's definitely good. I actually want to see something. What does it look like? What does the game look like if we just do this? Oh, no. Oh, wait. Oh, everybody's... Hold on. Clear everything. There we go. Let's just get this. There's a whole bunch of them. Oh, my. This is wrong on so many levels. It is the creepiest thing I think I've seen in a long time, but I do also... 
Wait a minute. Can I just... Did I just discover something? Wait one second. Let me select them. And then... What that? How did that... Whoa, what in the world? Oh, look at this. It, uh, it definitely works. I just spawned a whole bunch of them. Hold on. Let me just move it right here. Yeah, there we go. Yeah. I figured something out. You can totally spawn a whole bunch of them in by scroll wheeling. But now my game is lagging. So we need to we need to use the Monroe bomb. Bring it in. Uh, I don't, actually don't know if it's going to work. I don't know. I can't remember what the Monroe... Okay. Go away. Here we go. Three, two, one. Clean up my battlefield for me. Thank you. Maybe now my game won't lag as bad. Oh, it's still doing things. Hey, there we go. Did you know that's what's inside a carrot? Oh my goodness. Melon Sandbox has got some epic new mods. Bananas. You've already seen them. They're juicy and amazing. But you haven't seen this brand new weapon. It's a freaking dolphin with like a laser on it or something. Bananas here will be our first experiment. Oh, what's happening? Oh, I, I don't even see I don't even see the things coming out. It apparently shoots out something called chlorophytic bullets. What? Which Oh yeah, look at that. It's definitely a little different when it's unfrozen. It's like glowing. Look at what's look at what's happening to the bananas. Oh no. Guys, we have way more weapons and freaking crazy monsters in this video. What in the this is apparently some kind of melon in a cooler? And this is El Primo. <laughs> El Primo is a wrestler. And he's about to crack this little head thing open right here. Knock knock anybody home. And it's really weird that his both of his eyes are on one side of his head. He's so derpy looking. And his name is El Primo from the top rope. <laughs> oh, he <laughs> El Primo, you you might have missed, bro. This is chocolate, and chocolate does not like melons. Oh, look at him. He's really delicious. And this is the lightsaber gun, which is a brand new weapon. Let's see what it does. Oh, whoa, no way. It shoots out like laser bullets. Oh, oh we got some watermelon juice leaking out there. It's definitely a... Oh, no! It's definitely a, um, like a glass bowl. Needless to say, it's a glass bowl and watermelon juices are leaking out. You know what's worse than a regular watermelon? A front-facing melon. <laughs> Look at how weird he looks. He's really, really creepy. He's creeping me out. Look at his face. You're not supposed to look like this. I actually have a lot of different melons, like this guy, the buff melon. We have the cooler melon with the glass head. We've got this crazy thing. We've got a cursed melon. We've got an evil melon. Hmm. And we've even got this crazy melon thing and a virus melon. They're all very interesting, but they're here for a specific reason. This is the nine cat. <laughs> <laughs> but it's not just any old cat. It's not any old Nyan cat. It's the Nyan cannon. <laughs> Let's see what this thing does, shall we? And action. Oh, what the? Did it? Oh, my goodness. Mm. Wow. It's shooting out little lasers from all over itself. And it is a very very violent how is this cooler melon still alive this and it only shoots it looks like it shoots it out from the top side so if we put it hold on i gotta get rid of some stuff every week every week i find stronger and stronger weapons i don't think i meant to show this yet but that's okay <laughs> i was gonna save it for later but uh you know what let's just get a whole bunch of melons yeah you just go ahead and stand on the cat that's a great idea that's a- oh no, not like that. Not like this. Not like this. It's okay, we just- it's fine. It's fine. Alright, and now that we've got a nice pile of melons, Nyan Cat, activate! Oh jeez. Hey! He cleaned up my lag! Look at him covered in watermelon juice, still as cute as ever. Little Pop-Tart guy. You know who doesn't like cactuses? 
<laughs> robots. Robots hate cactuses. This robot is metal. 100% metal. And we're about to find out if metal can absolutely crush some uh, cactus. I think the best way to do it is like this. Oh, but I missed. Yep, there we go. Oh, I think that was very successful. Oh, I think we should try it with our fists now. Sure. Sure. Okay, it's kind of where. Oh, did he, dude. How can a robot die from that type of uh, attack? There's all kinds of weird things happening with this thing. You can make him into like an animal. There you go. There you go, little doggy. Nope, didn't work. Apple. Apple, are you afraid? You should be. There's a new dangerous foe in town. It's a zombie. <laughs> Look at him. He's pretty cool looking. But the question is, does he infect? Here you go. Go ahead, touch him right in the face. Oh, juicy. You get infected? No? Oh, I was hoping maybe that would... Maybe he would infect him or something. Whoa, things are getting a little weird over here, okay? Eat the brains! Eat the apple brains, I guess. I don't- apples don't have brains. But eat them! Yeah! Guys, there's a monster I've yet to show you. I'm very excited about. But first, maybe we can experiment with something. I found a cryogenic capsule where you can do experimentation. What in the- it's apparently called the incubator. And it works legitimately. What is this? What? What in the- he just changed into a red apple? Wait, how did that even work? What, what's even occurring here? I don't even- I don't understand the actual things that are occurring here. Some kind of pipe is shooting out- I don't even know you could do these things in this game. Okay, we got an apple? What? I don't even- is this a carrot? It's with the carrot. He's being changed. Can I just load one of these in here or something? What is this little capsule thing? I mean, whoa! Um, I don't think it's supposed to do that. Okay, can you stop? Stop for a second. What's this button do? Okay. Um. Hmm. Yeah. Seems like it makes sense. You gotta put the fire out. One second. Here we go. Put the fire out. He's a little toasty. Uh, yeah, what's this button do over here? Oh, it's another one of those little frozen things. Let's stop that. How, where do you, I, where do I load? Oh, right here. I think if I, let me, uh, well, I did not mean to do that. There is a syringe in here. So if we take that syringe out and let's load in this black one, because I don't know what the heck that is, but let's find out. And we do this. What, ooh, he got changed into black. Oh, does it only work on actual colors? Wait, he's being painted. How about we try, let's try a blue one. Blue, a blue one, would the blue one work? Get in there, all the way, there you go, and... Yep, oh, it's definitely making blue appear, but it's not actually changing anything. Let's, let's try green, maybe green will, maybe green will work, since there is, there is no actual green. There's only a green, a red one, but he apparently can be changed. Wait a minute. It's being injected into this thing. You can hear it making noise. So if I inject... Oh my goodness. What the heck? Can you... Does this actually work? Oh my... It's painting them... It's painting red. Oh my... That's amazing. Although it's not working. Somebody much smarter than me will have to explain that to me. It's time to eat some ragdolls. Apple from Minecraft, I've got a surprise for you. This is the mushroom monster. Oh <laughs> my, he, he looks friendly, doesn't he? Let's see what happens here. Little apple boy about to encounter some kind of terror. Look at that mouth, man. He can straight up eat your whole body, probably. Okay. Look at his weird little mushroom hand. Come here. Whoa, his head is getting it. Oh, wait. First of all, can we Im like, impale this thing with this head? Yo oh, yeah. Apple juice coming out. Apple juice. Everybody needs apple juice. Oh, man. let's. We're making apple crisp. Everybody likes a little banana. <sighs> Look at that. He's ready to eat them. Let's see. Come over here. Come closer. Come on. 
Come closer to me. Okay, no big deal. Come over there. <laughs> oh my goodness. He doesn't want the head. He just wants the whole body. Look at him. Look at Banana still alive fighting against it. Not gonna work. You're going in there. Mmm, delicious. <laughs> oh, poor Apple. Ooh, it looks like Men in Playground's got some new things we gotta check out. First up, we have pear. We got melon, pumpkin, corn, apple, cactus, and now pear, which is a good ad addition. And man, he's very bright green. I like the green color. Yeah. Normally, cursed monster carrots would be a problem, but not when you have a circular what? saw. This thing must waste so much that he's literally bending over. <laughs> yeah, let's grind them up, shall we? Let's make some carrots who flay. Touch it to his face. There you go. Oh my goodness! There's carrot juice coming everywhere. Whoa, take it easy. Don't don't damage yourself. Get the carrot. That is the weirdest way I've ever seen anybody actually try to make carrot juice. Oh my, what is happening? Whoa, look out! Wow, that was a close one. Bet we do need to make some pear juice. Let's see what oh the color the color is right that's pretty cool guess what there's not just only a pair there's also other amazing things check it out there's a banana oh my goodness he's perfect look at him he's got a little banana top here so wonderful and then he's yep he's got legs everything else is how you would expect it to be there can be only one fruit <laughs> i am highlander banana Chum. oh no did he oh he did get him right in the foot that's not quite how oh what is happening that's not quite how highlander did it but we'll we'll try it again maybe He's swinging the sword like an insane person. There you go. We've got pear juice. Yeah, make him make a pear juice. Oh no, that is that's just wrong on every level. Let's see what other delightful things are in here, shall we? Oh my, that's a penguin. Likes to catch and eat fish. Has a skeleton and flesh. I sure would hope so. <laughs> He's perfect. He's actually, look at this. Look at the size of him. He's tiny. I freaking love it. Oh, <gasps> you know what I've never thought about before? <laughs> but I just did. A penguin with a sawed-off shotgun. That seems about right. Pick it up. Oh, no. He has no button to activate. Can you actually not pick it up? Here, let, let me help you. Here you go. Okay. Time to make some banana pudding. Oh, oh, no. What happened to the penguin? It's okay. He's He's fine. That penguin is just made out of ketchup, tomatoes, or something, okay? No need to be alarmed. This is a fruit game after all. We're not doing anything. Uh, what is that? A bumper car? It's a bumper car. <laughs> what? Totally forgot that there's a... Dude, there's a whole vehicle section. Is, this, is it under here? There it is. Wait, is this melon cooler? What the heck is that? I've never even seen that. Okay, we need to pit the vehicles. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Do we no listen? He's got a little, like, uh, quack noise to it. Hold on. That's so ridiculous. Okay. We need to put two different things in here. We need... We need... Can this even... How can... Can't fit in... Oh. That works. <laughs> that seems about right. Let's put the pair in the bumper car. Because that's always fun. Can you actually... Wait, how's he... How's he going in there? He's not even fitting in there. And why didn't he turn around? Maybe he needs to sit down. Let's... Can I... Can I even make him sit? I've never actually made anything sit in this game. Yeah, you can. There you go. That doesn't seem right, though. But let's test it. <laughs> Next! What the heck is the X DeLorean? Can fit three NPCs? Looks like a freaking rocket boosted sled. Yeah, there it is. It looks like it, it looks exactly like that's what it is. Okay, here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna grab the buff melon. He's gonna ride in the front, just like that. <laughs> we're gonna grab the, uh, let's see, we got it. Oh yeah, the apple from Minecraft. Okay, there he goes. And, oh yeah, there we go. Cursed corn, that's the one I want. Yep, broken leg, okay. Now, do they need to sit in there or what? Let's see. Oh, you know what we didn't do with the other, with the bumper car thing? Is actually, dude, these guys, none of them, none of them know how to properly sit. Can, now, can I activate this vehicle? No, you can't, but it's, look at that, there you go. Yeah, uh-huh, yeah. 
That seems about right. Make some apple. Oh no, look at the vehicles getting covered in apple juice. I'm hungry now. Look at that delicious thing. Oh look, it's Dwayne the Rock Johnson. <laughs> Got a kettlebell in his hand. Let's see what else is in here. Maybe there's something new we have yet to see. Some kind of crazy beast or being. There's a melon in oh ear flaps. Okay, we saw the laser. There's the virus melon. TT Tahu, we saw that. Okay. Uh I don't I don't see it. What's that? Functional doorbell? I guess we'll find out what this Eva 01 is. Doesn't look as cool as some of the other things, like a banana. But it should be. Oh my goodness. Wait, does it have like a unicorn horn on its head? It's kind of what it looks like. What is this thing? I think it's like. Dude, is that a. You have, you have a weapon on your hand? Those are like. We, those are like some kind of. Plasma blaster or something. This thing looks insane. I'm not too sure what it is, but it's some kind of futuristic warrior. It came to this planet to destroy all the penguins, starting with this one. Oh, <laughs> oh no. Oh, the. Well, two shots is all it's needed to obliterate a penguin. How many penguins can it take out in one hit? I in no way endorse this, okay? And nobody better freaking call PETA right now, okay? I don't want to hear anything about it. And goodbye. Oh, penguin juices for everybody. It's just baked penguin with tomato juice inside. It seems, what, it seems, this seems like, you know, the most power, one of the most powerful weapons in the game. There's Jack Sparrow. We got Jack Sparrow mods and stuff. I love that this banana is on a scooter. <laughs> Anybody else? You know who really likes penguins? You shouldn't have messed with. Shouldn't have messed with the penguins. He's a, a, a avid penguin lover. It's Dwayne the Rock Johnson, and he's mad. He's got a big old hammer, which I'm sure will uh, cause lots of problems if I can actually hit, which I did. Good job. Lots of problems if I can actually hit, which I did. Good job. He just dropped it. He's like, I'm done here. I've, I've avenged the penguins. I actually think he dropped it because his arm broke. Let's see. Can he pick it up? No, <laughs> it's totally broken. It's not supposed to bend that way, Dwayne Rocky boy. What's his real name? I can't imagine his real name is Dwayne. It's got to be something else. Dwayne Michael Smith Norman the Third or some stupid thing like that. And you, oh, yeah, there you go. Good job, Dwayne. You, I guess you've joined your penguin brothers. Well, once again, we played Melon Playground. We've created a lot of juices and. Uh, We'll see what other mods they come up with the next time. Oh, hey there, Mr. Cursed Corn. You want to see what kind of new mods there are today? Oh, there's a new Apple Man. And what the heck is the void gun? <laughs> Download. We got a football air horn. That better make some things go flying. But what we're really interested in is some kind of beast. Oh, a monkey. Oh my, this might be the most powerful thing oh. yet. Normal melon? Cursed melon. <laughs> what? What is that? What happened? What happened to him? There's some kind of, I don't know, infection or something? Oh no, that's not good. He's got an axe. He's ready to chop up some watermelon. There we go. Get it, get it in a nice slices so we can enjoy it for dinner. Oh, that's a little bit more than what I was thinking. You can just kind of keep chopping at it. Look at all those watermelon juices. Comment below, which apple did it better? <laughs> the apple from Melon Playground or the apple from Minecraft? One is definitely way more red, but one doesn't ha one, you're missing a leaf. You see the difference between the heads? Do you feel the difference between the heads? No? No, oh no! Oh no. <laughs> we like applesauce over here. Look, they both turned into applesauce. Although there's just one little splatter of applesauce over here on this side. But he is definitely uh, apple crisp if you get- No, let's make apple crisp actually. You know who hates apples the most? Pumpkin. 
because pumpkins have to compete with apples during the time of the year where the pumpkins should flourish. Everyone's getting their apple cider and not drinking their pumpkin spice. This is what we think of your apple cider. Yeah, there we go. You like it, pumpkin? You want to eat some apple crisp? Look, you're very crunchy now. All right, so let's see here. I think we need to go ahead and line up a bunch of guys. So let's get all these guys together. We're going to line them up because we're going to test just how powerful this next thing is. So this is the void gun. And the void gun apparently goes through objects very easily. Let's find out. Oh, what does... What just happened? What? Have we ever seen this before? I don't think we have. Look at... Maybe we... No, I definitely didn't have this downloaded. This is far more extreme than anything we've seen yet. Although I do think we might have something that's even more powerful. But I need to really test this out. Okay, I got myself a nice little pile of bodies here. So many that it's uh, making my game lag. So let's just go ahead and fire. Clean it up. Oh, you couldn't even see it. You can't, you can't even see it. Look at all the fruit juices on the bottom of the ground, though. Uh, yeah, you can't even... There we go. You can't even see the bullet really travel through things. It's so fast. Oh, dude, the, the, are the fruits invincible? I think the fruits are... In, the cactus fruits are invincible to the void gun. Oh, that's kind of cool. Apple? <laughs> Meat monkey. <laughs> what the heck? Why does this monkey have such a fat gut? I don't understand what is going on with this thing. He's very, like tinted too he's just like a tint look at how weird his stomach looks what is happening with this thing ooh, 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 ooh. yeah there you go monkey that dude the apple's still alive you can withstand monkey attacks oh no poor little monkey i don't even know what he turned into just a heap of monkey parts apple where'd you get that atom gun from what are you gonna do with it? Clean up the monkey mess? Oh, I forgot it did that. <laughs> okay. Uh, that is not what I expected it to do. I totally forgot about that. It did not quite clean up the monkey mess how I thought. But fear not, that's just uh, mon a monkey made of out of tomatoes. This is Atlas, and Atlas has a legendary weapon from a far distant universe. The football air horn. <laughs> <laughs> okay, here you go, Atlas. Let's find out what happens. Please be powerful. Oh. Wait. Oh, I thought it literally lagged and it was going to obliterate him. No, it doesn't do anything. It's the biggest disappointment of all time. Equally as terrifying as the fire extinguisher. This better work. Yeah. You like that? You getting cold? Huh? Huh? No? Nothing? Oh, that's also unfortunate. You need heavier firepower, I think. I call forth the satellite! <laughs> what the heck? This is a satellite. This apparently is the strongest weapon ever created in this game. And uh, Atlas here has brought it forth. Let us see the power of the satellite. <gasps> what, the, what the heck is it doing even? It's literally... What is it shooting out of there? Laser beam? That's just like... Wait. Oh, no. I can't... Oh, wait, 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 wait. Sometimes if you have it frozen, it won't work properly. Hold on. Let's see. It can only... It can only fire one... One time. Oh, get off the screen. Let's see this. Let's hold it down. Oh, I knew it. I freaking knew it. No way. Oh! <laughs> We need a lot of things. Okay, we got a, okay, a monkey broke. No big deal. We don't need your legs, monkey. We just need your body. That's all we need. Just a whole pile of monkeys. Yeah, there we go. Get all your monkey friends in one place and watch what happens when the we unleash the satellite on the world. Oh, monkey lag. Never a good thing. Any disease or something from monkeys is never good. Here we go. Hold it down. Oh, you can't even see. It's so it was so laggy we couldn't even see. We got it. We got to do this again. Okay, there we go. That should be good. And oh <laughs> my gosh, that is def. Okay, so I thought that that void gun was the most powerful. Clearly, we have a new winner. All right. I don't really know what this thing is. Kind of has like a Majin Buu feel to it, but it's. I mean, it's obviously from something. 
It's also like blinking. Whoever Jax is, I don't even know. Please don't let it be a popular character that I should know because uh, <laughs> I don't. Can we spike this guy on this horn thing of his? Uh, let's get your get your head up there. Get there you go. J perfect. That is exactly what we want to see. Okay, freeze all your body parts. And now that you're good, let's take Apple's head and... Oh, I missed. Hold on. I always miss the first time. We'll try again. Oh. Uh, <laughs> we didn't miss. He disintegrated. Maybe the better way would be to do it like this. Let's... Can I grab him by the antenna thing? Oh. Yeah. Okay, now. Uh, Apple survived. But clearly this thing didn't. I don't think you can actually skewer him with this weird little... Whatever that that's gotta be like an oh oh wait a minute maybe I can okay okay maybe not I don't freaking know I'm freaking out man this game really like makes me lose my mind sometimes what's Sam oh hi Sam you look weird he's kind of like a robot melon look at him he's got a melon head robot body whatever this lower part is I don't even know can you do anything special probably not oh Let's get the Minecraft apple. There you go. We haven't really seen him that much. Do I have anything else? Oh, I thought there was a panda for a second. I was like, I don't remember downloading a panda, but okay. Hey, man. You know what you need? A butt bomb. Oh, my gosh. There we go. That's what I always like to do. Head standing to a butt bomb. Oh, knee. A knee. A knee bomb. How about another one? Ugh. Make some apple crisp. There we go. We've got some apple juices going on. I can safely say I'm a little disappointed by uh by by the football air horn. I really expected that to do something, but I am glad that the other one definitely has the uh, satellite does quite a bit. Do we have any other uh, crazy mod things here? What the heck, medieval armor? Can you wear that? Oh wow, sweet! Yeah, we do. want a helmet too. Yeah, there you go. You need something else? What are these pads? How about ooh? Can you just, can I just load things on him? How about a top hat? <laughs> you like top hat? Top hat in our medieval, oh, you need a dress? There you go. <laughs> He's looking real good. Okay. Oh, apparently if you put too many things on somebody, you can, they crumble? I mean, I guess technically that's like real life physics. Did it take a lot of clothes. I don't actually know how I feel about that. <laughs> I guess uh, with that being said, I think we'll be done. And I guess we'll just have to wait till next time when this mod refreshes and see what other horrors we find in here. <gasps> oh yeah, we did have the Dark Samurai. Maybe we'll check him out next time. That is a turkey with a knife. Download! And that is a mashed potato. Today we're back in Melon Playground and <laughs> there's some really good mods. Oh look, there's a turkey? Somebody named Reggie? What the heck are these? You know what I don't like about potatoes? When you mix up like mashed potatoes and there's clumps in it, you gotta mix it up real good. Today I've got a solution to that problem. Turkey. <laughs> Turkey with an M2 browning. What? <laughs> no! Mr. Turkey's gone crazy! Let's see what happens! Oh, yeah. Oh, dude, freaking. Is that butter coming out of there? This mashed potato's got butter coming out of him. Wow. Uh, I think we've mashed them up enough. I'm a little disappointed that turkey just died. He just died. I'm a little disappointed the turkey can't actually hold things. He, he, he's not quite capable. Here, let's drop him back in. There you go. Look at him. He's beautiful. He can't pick it up, though, which is very disappointing. But we can make it look like he's holding it. Sort of. Really? Not really? <laughs> Hey, Mr. Turkey, we're gonna cook you up for dinner, too. Don't worry, that's just watermelon juices. You know, it's better than a turkey? <laughs> a turkey NPC. <laughs> Look at it! What the heck, you guys? Okay, I know Thanksgiving's over, but I didn't see these before Thanksgiving, so we gotta... Oh! You want watermelon turkey for... Thanksgiving? Jeez. Oh, Every time I play Melon Playground, my goal is to find monsters that are terrifying. And I found a really nice, uh, crazy looking one. But before I show you that, this thing is a new melon. And he's facing off against whatever the heck this thing is. This is a cornucopia. And it's an actual thing. Look at it. 
It's an actual being. Look, you can see the little cornucopia head thing, the point, and then a weird fruit thing in the face. Say hello to my little friend. <laughs> we got a freaking Tommy gun in this game now. There's like a World War One or something edition, World War Two. And so there's a whole bunch of new weapons. And then I also have, uh, well, I'll show you in a little bit. But let's see what happens to the cornucopia. Oh, I don't know what's coming out of that. That, this thing fires so fast. Look at him. What juices is coming out of a cornucopia? I don't even know if they have juices, but something's definitely coming out. Someone's here to get vengeance on his cornucopia friend. Gobble, freaking gobble. Now we found a turkey that can actually hold the weapon. It's Reggie. Look at this goofy thing. What the heck? And he is holding uh, the bar. <laughs> Look at his little scrawny legs. All right, we're gonna start at the feet and work our way up to the head. Are you ready? Take that. Okay, he just bend. Oh, wh whoa, look. He actually looks like he's got seeds in him. He's a real true life melon. That's epic. Oh my goodness. I don't know which one of these weapons is more powerful. This seems, I don't know, this might be better than the Browning. And better than the Thompson? Eh, no, the Thompson's probably better. Have you ever seen a turkey with a machine gun before? <laughs> I don't think so. As I said, it usually try to find a monster every time we play this game, and today I did find a good one. But before I show you that, I'll show you this armored up melon. We're gonna put it to the test and see how much it can withstand. So, Apple, you need some weapons. So let us start with my mom's lucky machete. <laughs> <laughs> All right, come over here. We're gonna make some melon juice. Please work. Oh, he, he was. Oh, he withstood that. How about if can you withstand a jab? <gasps> oh, wow! He actually withstood the jab. Okay, what about right to the good? It. Wow! I'm very, I'm very surprised. Now, this is the ultimate test. Okay, you stand up, Apple. You come over here and uh, assume the position. There you go, and. Uh, you missed him. Let's try again. Ready? And... Okay. Turns out, looks like Apple might have suffered some problems. So what we need to do is uh, we need to position the weapon in such a way that uh, he will hit it and potentially become, uh, I don't know, melon juices. There's no way for him to actually... Hold on. Let me get Apple out of the way. No way for him to miss now, right? Yeah. Ooh. I think he still withstood that, but he didn't get impaled or anything. Oh, okay, we split him in half. It turns out- oh, there it went. It turns out that the the armor actually works pretty well. Okay, give me those watermelon juices. I'm hungry. Oh, Mr. Banana. Meat seek. Look at that. He looks, he looks really good, actually. Oh, I love the outline and stuff. I like it. From a graphic designer standpoint, you look really cool. You got the, the dots and stuff. You know, people make this stuff. I mean, it takes a long time to get that just right. And... Wait, hold on. He's got a big eyeball. We gotta hit him with that instead. Yeah! Oh. Whoa, he's got... You can seek and bleed? I had no idea. You... Oh, okay. How about eyeball smash on the back of the banana? Yeah, we're making some banana pudding over here or something I, I don't really know but clearly banana is <laughs> he's been hurt so I think the melon thing is probably the craziest looking monster that we found so far but I think we might have found one that actually rivals this thing it could now be the best one comment below and let me know if you think that the melon is or if you think this one is. Look at those toes. Oh my gosh. He is creepy looking. He's covered in black stuff. These are his fingers. They're crazy gangly fingers. Spikes on his back. And then behold the head. Oh. Uh, oh, is this a... Okay, this is a woman. I didn't even realize. It's a woman monster. And she is terrifying. I don't know which... I don't know which one's... Which one's more crazy looking? The melon? I mean, it's kind of cool that this is very creative. It's a melon that's like become a monster. But this thing is pretty freaking crazy cool looking. 
I don't know. Comment below which one you like more. We need to find out who is the ultimate monster, but you have to decide. Okay, well, stand up, please. Don't be all weird. The only thing I wish this game, like, would do better is actually, like, let you have abilities on weapon on, on monsters or, like, let the teeth on this thing actually work. Yeah, pet him. You want to get punched? Or let the, the fingers, like, actually, like, uh, you know, jab into him. Man, she's freaking crazy look at she's just made watermelon oh she lost an arm okay geez uh but where did the arm even go actually or the arm is in here did the arm disintegrate or something we just got a bunch of melon where seriously where did her arm go there's there's no arm did he did the melon thing actually eat it or something it's just completely gone. I'm very- hold on, let's try with the foot. I'm very surprised right now. Kick it! Yeah! I want to just see what- maybe the foot just literally disappeared after- oh, okay. Well, here's the head. Maybe we'll call this the Blackberry Monster. Because it's, you know, dripping out some blackberry juices. And it's dark, you know, like a blackberry. So it's a-, it's a it's been- it's a mutated blackberry. Look, the spikes on the back of the head. I wish that they could act, actually do something or like the fingers on the melon thing. I also wish I could like control the- you know, like in People Playground when you hit A and D, like it like, actually made it like work better or whatever. Yeah! Okay, well anyway, that's the monster. It's pretty freaking terrifying, I think. I didn't think that the mods for Melon Sandbox could get any crazier than what they already are, but I was wrong. I really don't know who to start with in terms of these mods, because there's a lot of them, but uh, I thought we'd start with this guy, <laughs> who is like, I don't know, is he Banana's brother? What, what is he? <gasps> is he a lemon? <gasps> he might be a lemon. There can be only one yellow creature. Yeah, you're right. <laughs> there can be only one. He has a weapon that weighs so much he's literally falling over and why is he turning transparent look look at him he can't even get there oh he's oh he's trying to get up and <laughs> it's not working too well what are you doing this uh gigantic thing that he can barely control is called the weapon bolter which i think is from warhammer 40k let's uh start with some toes shall we Oh, <laughs> he's, you got banana, your banana toes are gone. Oh, shall we make some banana pudding? I think so. That is so loud. I'm probably going to go deaf, but at least we made some nice yummy pudding. You know that you can actually, oh no, I didn't mean to do that. You can actually kind of, well, he, he is still alive. The strongest creature ever oh my this monster might be one of the most hideous ones yet I mean, i'll show you that in a little bit he or she might not look like much <laughs> it's the mushroom and uh, it means business look at this <laughs> what do we have here it's called the firefly are you scared i'm a little weirded out by the mushroom maybe because it looks like you know that skin but i know it's like toadstool stuff but it's still really weird. Anyway. Oh, what? What's... What's it shooting? It's got, like, a spread shot of, I don't know, shotgun shots or something? Hmm, watermelon juices. Are you talking to me? Are you talking to me? Oh, I literally came out of my house for the first time in, like, three years, and you were going to start something with me? Well, you messed with the wrong fruit. I'm purple, and I mean business. It's not a grape. It's a plum, and I like plums a lot. This might be one of my favorite fruits in the game. Don't mess with the plum pear, or you get uppercutted in your big pear face. Oh, yeah, well, I mean business. Oh, no. Oh, yeah, well, I mean even bigger business with my gigantic hammer of doom. Oh, jeez. Well, I see, I see why you dropped it. Uh, this arm's looking a little flimsy. Well, I tried to pick it up with the other one, and then this happened. <laughs> Turns out, uh, Plum is not very good at picking up using weapons. It's, it's the Plum juices just keep falling out of them. Who would have thought that the pair would win this battle? I surely didn't. Whoa! 
look, everybody! It's Nightmare Freddy! Doesn't he look awesome? He looks really good. I like him. Oh, we've reached a whole new level in this game. It's not just Freddy. There's, there's more. I do have a question. Can Freddy use his big head? Eat this little cherry right here. Look at that. Look at that. He can almost eat his whole... The whole head can almost fit in his mouth. That's pretty impressive, Freddy. All right, you stay just like that, Cherry. You need to... Can I, can I like, make you a plank? Well, oh, that was close. Here we go. In his mouth. Oh, well, it didn't quite go in his mouth, but uh, we did have some good results. Uh, we've got cherry juices everywhere. What? Springtime. Look at this. Okay, listen. Watch. Why does she sound like that when you drop her? Listen to that. Listen to Apple. Doesn't... Wait, because she's an animatronic? Even the drop sound sounds like that? Guys, there's something in this game that I've never tested before. But if it works, we can slice this apple into a whole bunch of pieces really easily. It's not a cheese grater, but it definitely looks like it. This is a tennis racket. And I really hope that this will work. What we need to do is take the head like so and swing really hard down on top of it. Okay, well, it didn't quite hit, but Apple is missing some parts of the back of his head. So maybe it was successful. Let's try one more time. Nope, it didn't quite, it didn't quite work. There's no slicing or grating of any kind happening. Just tennis racket bashing. What in the world? It's an actual girl, like legit person. This is, is this like the first real person we've seen in this game? Look at, she's got like little shoes, little heels or whatever. She's got some pants on, nice little jacket. She looks like a school uniform or something. Like she's, from, like, is she supposed to be from some kind of anime or something? Anyway, I was going to test this one thing out on her, but then I realized she's not a fruit. She's a person and we can't have people having problems, if you know what I mean. Or YouTube will be like, can't show that so wrong. Because YouTube sounds like a five-year-old girl. <laughs> what? Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, children of all ages, this is an apple. And today we have a first of its kind, not the apple. No, it's a real robot. It's called the the K-I-L-L bot. Okay, I'm not gonna say it because YouTube doesn't like that word. But uh, anyway, look at it. It's got like a Segway wheel on the bottom. I really wonder, can we make it walk? Let's see what happens if it walks. Please roll or something. That would be amazing. Is it gonna roll? No, it's just trying to hop or something. You weirdo. Stop doing what you're doing. Look at it. It's freaking out. Okay. Well, it won't even stand up and it won't even sit down. It won't do anything. It's just weird, kind of broken. Maybe let's try a uh, stop animation. Maybe that'll work. <laughs> you flatten out at least. Now, can you stand? Oh, he's standing. Yeah. Let's use this new M16 out against this apple. Oh, make some applesauce. Yeah, that's working out quite well. You're true to your name, robot man. He's made out of metal and he does have a giant wheel. So he might even be better at, oh yeah. Oh, you don't need that. You just need this part. The, the bottom wheel part. Okay, here, I'll just do it myself. He's just gonna keep missing. There we go. Yeah, that worked out quite well. Do you know what's better than a capybara? <laughs> Not one capybara, but two. That's instantly better. But also, samurai capybara. <laughs> what the heck? Someone made a capybara samurai warrior, and he looks, he looks legit. Look at his little pads and stuff, man. You mess with the wrong freaking animal, cactus boy. Yeah, take that. Take it again. Oh, look at that. Knocked your little fruit off. Give me that other fruit. Capybaras are hungry. They want to eat you. Yeah, get out of here. Get you want the fruit. Here you go, capybara. Hey, what happens if we... Yeah, wow. Did you see how, did you see how brutal? Watch this, ready? Yeah. Whoa! That's some samurai skills you've got there, man. Although... <laughs> A little bit of an issue back here. I don't know. Coming out of his hat. Heads up. He can make him fly. <sighs> there we go. You need to retrieve your sword, sir. Just lodged in the back of said cactus. 
Oh, he actually picked it back up again? I didn't think he would do that. Well, this game is pretty... <laughs> what are you, like a zombie dog or something? What the... Look at it. It's like not even blocky. It's circular, which is freaking me out. But it's actually not circular. When you zoom out, look, he looks he looks fine. But when you get closer, it's all pixelated perfectly. There's only one way to truly eliminate this thing, and and that's with a gigantic nuclear bomb. <laughs> Will it explode if it lands? Let's see. No, it didn't. Wow. You just gonna let it's just gonna you're just gonna have fun with it? Okay, well this will take care of you. Boom! What if he's still alive? No, he's not. He's he's totally gone. Here's part of his body over here. Pretty sure that this is another robot, but it looks like he's not functioning. He's all black, and he he doesn't even does he even have an eye. I mean, I think maybe this square in the front is his eye, but it doesn't actually look like he's working at all. Banana Man, sir, what do you want? Are you ready to take some vengeance on the robots for what they did to you? I told you to never tell anyone about that, but yes, I am. And that is why I have this weapon right here. Now this is the atomizer. Where to go? This is the atomizer weapon. And uh, atomizer, you know, like it should work on biologicals. I don't know if it should work on robots, unless of course this is an android, but we, we shall test it. Oh, look at that. It actually doesn't work. What if we superheat it? That might work. Get all hot and spicy. Oh no, the banana is having issues. Whoa, what happened to? Okay, wow, it must be an android. We're taking off the outer fruit layer to reveal the inner circuitry. Too bad banana can't see the results. He is, he's turned into, he's turned into some weird brown gray thing. He didn't even get burned. He just got all weird and moldy looking. What the heck? It is the Terminator. <laughs> no, I knew it. What is this thing? Look, he's got like antennas or hair or something. He's got a glowing eye. He's terrifying. His name is Shadow. He has, <laughs> um... This thing? It might look like a sword at first, but it's actually not a sword. It's a lightsaber gun. It's a like a laser blaster. And it's pretty I mean it's slow shooting. But it's really effective in making applesauce. I wish it did function like half as a sword though, too, because that'd be pretty cool. I mean, really, in this game, if you hit anything hard enough, it can definitely be a sword. It has the look of a sword, but you can kind of see it has the lightsaber hilt. I think that's what it's supposed to I think we need a fresh one. <laughs> Let's get a fresh one. There we go. Now you can kind of see the lightsaber hilt. This laser, though, is not powerful enough. I do have one that's definitely better than this. You remember this thing? Oh, I, I've got to, I remember. I got to take my headphone off so I don't die. Okay, from my eardrums exploding. Here it is. Oh man! Wow, that is very loud and very, very devastating. All that's left is a rib cage of some of one of them. I don't know. And whatever this thing is, we have probably one of the best monsters I've ever seen. Not this guy. This monster, though, it might be like rank number two now after the melon thing. It's pretty terrifying. Here it is. What is this thing? Look at this freaking face. Its mouth goes all the way back to the back of his head. Then not only that, it doesn't have arms. It has these things. Oh my, what the heck is, th oh, are these little nubs? They're terrifying looking. And then not only that, hold on, let me pause it. Let me freeze this arm, okay? Look, look at its stomach, it's gone. Where did his stomach go? Why is he looking like this? Then he, then make it matters worse. Okay, this is, t this is freaking me out. He has normal feet and like legs. It's like he's some kind of, I don't know, plague zo You know what he reminds me of? Those things from Left 4 Dead. Anyway, you know what we gotta test out? He's called the Resident Massacre Monster and I don't know what that means. We have to test out if these little nub things can 
penetrate this watermelon's body. Hey, 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 smell it. Doesn't it smell yummy? You, sir, are a freak. You gotta pay for those words. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I think with enough force, maybe. Oh, man, I don't know. What, what is this white spot that appeared? Dude, oh, they can't. They can't penetrate the watermelon's body. Come on. Get it in there. Ah, oh, that's very upsetting. One more. Here we go. The ultimate. Ah. Oh, did we do it? No, I think we just kind of broke him. What? Someone explain to me what this white dot is. Oh, he's, oh, he's trying to eat it through his, through his stomach hole. That's gross, man. He wants to wear the watermelon body like a trophy. He's kind of a weirdo. You know, there is something in this game that I don't think we've actually ever experimented with. Ugh, big old... Where did it go? <laughs> it's gone. Oh, it, it actually rolls. Well, that's even better. Here you go. Zoom. Oh! <laughs> we need another test subject. Don't worry, this guy was actually like a banana that turned, so it's banana juice. Although, it's red, so maybe it's uh, banana juice with cherry juice from all the cherries he's eaten and watermelon. The game is currently paused for a very good reason. We have all of our friendly fruits lined up here. Oh, I've got a lot of them. And uh, down the path, down here, is uh, that thing. And it's moving at a very high speed. And we're about to watch what happens when I resume it. Here we go in three, two, one coming any moment now there it is <laughs> this is how you make smoothies take a lesson vitamix your machines are garbage compared to this process and then it explodes <laughs> it exploded and sent that thing flying and now all we have is a bunch of juice body parts laying here this thing does have a weapon on top so uh if we angle it down a little bit well it just Win on its own? Look, look at that! Wait, can it? Oh, start driving. Stop. What? I had no idea that this did this. Are you kidding me? Hold on, pause the game. Freeze them. There we go. Target practice time. No way! I didn't know that. Do some more. Wow! That thing, this thing is pretty gruesome. Well, okay, what the heck happened? There we go. Look at all that's left is this little leaf thing. I had no idea that you could do that. Disable gravity? Wait, since when? Did you always disable gravity? I can make flying projectiles. What am I doing with my life? Hey, he's flying. Hold on, what happens if I... He just freeze his head. Wait, yeah, he's just hanging out here. His body's still moving. That's kind of nice, actually. Oh, uh, so you know what I'm gonna do? <laughs> I'm gonna make something fly. It's gonna be a scooter. Cause why not? Here you go, Mr. Sc Dude, those- Does that scooter have saw blades on its wheels? Hold on, let's see. Uh, where's the- di There it is. Disable gravity. And here we go. And wait. Isn't- Whoa, what's it doing? Okay, here we go. And three, two, one. Oh, it worked. So there was a really big update for Melon Sandbox. It's gonna be a good one. Oh my, look at all these amazing things that we get to play with today. Icy Candy Gun? The Avalancher? <laughs> and then there's just, there's even more down here. This is a fruit. It's not really Santa Claus. And the Easter Bunny is a fruit wearing a costume. It's not real. Okay, it needs to be stated before we get into this. And they're about to have some serious problems. Nothing quite says season's greetings like the holly drill. Hey, haha, <laughs> you, Apple, are the first contestant to test the holiday stuff. Now stand still and behold the beauty. Make us- wait, what the heck is happening? Is it not- does it not work? It's not drilling! No worries, I'm sure the tree sword will come in handy. 
Oh, we got some juices on there. It doesn't quite uh, seem to be as sharp as one would think. I would think that this star would be very pokey, but apparently it's not quite the, to the same level as some of the other uh, pokey weapons. Although that was pretty effective. Dana's got some uh, applesauce in his beard. Perhaps what we need is a uh, buffer melon and a brand new sword. This is called the Holly Jolly Sword, and it's it's extremely festive looking. Look at looks like a scythe. Let us test this thing out against the cherry. Here comes your doom. <laughs> yeah, how do you how would you use this? A, like a poke, or maybe a slash down, or ooh, better yet, a hook. Let's get let's get it over his head. Uh, get it. Uh, okay, it didn't quite didn't quite work out exactly how we anticipated but I have to imagine that we can hook a head like around this little hoop area very difficult to get anything inside there maybe maybe we actually can but the best way to probably use this is like this there we go yeah now we're getting some cherries cherries over here cherry drink so here's our first projectile weapon the candy gun. Sorry, it's actually the icy candy gun, which probably has a, a good implication. You know, we don't listen, Pear. Pear needs some pants. We need to be full on Santa, not just half Santa. Let's test this out and see what happens. Let's start with the toe. Oh, okay, just a normal. Oh, look, the bullets are blue. It's a normal, ordinary looking projectile weapon, uh, except for the fact that it is shooting ice bullets, which is pretty cool. Because it, you know, it's really good at... Because then what you get is, not only do you get the smoothie, but you, you make sure it's really cold, too. What was this? Oh, yeah, an apple. Also, uh, Santa... I don't think Santa's coming for Christmas this year, everybody. He's, uh... He's, <laughs> he's been very messed up with... Look at his leg. I'm kind of disappointed that there's no snow level. There needs to be snow, and we need to have it because you can't have a Christmas update without it. But you know what you do need for a Christmas update? <laughs> a candy cane. Not just any candy cane, a gigantic candy cane gun. Look at the size of this thing. Can you hold, can you even hold this? Oh, you can't even pick it up. Look, we got the trigger right here. Here's the barrel. <laughs> what the heck, what does it shoot? Please something amazing, let's see. Oh, no, it's just a normal ordinary thing. Okay, wait the heck. I mean, it looks amazing and it shoots incredibly fast, but it's just a normal ordinary weapon. How can I, I want to get it to fling around? There we go. Uh, okay, either way. Yeah, there we go. Either way, this thing is freaking awesome and it's gigantic too. <laughs> I love it. Nothing says Christmas quite like the desert. And uh, nothing says Christmas quite like Santa Claus getting vengeance on the Easter Bunny for trying to steal his fame. And he has a new weapon. <laughs> Look at the size of this thing. It's actually wieldable when you change the size barely. But it's so big, we can definitely pick up an entire, an entire guy in this. Let's just see. We can get Santa inside here. Santa, can you go inside? Yeah, there you go. <laughs> hey, use this. Use the power of your own being to fling it around. There we go. So let's see what happens when we fling this thing. <laughs> Pay no attention to Santa Claus. He's over here on the side having problems. Let's see what happens when we fling this thing at full force against. Let's line it up against the Easter Bunny. We're gonna flip it. Okay, ready? Three. Two, one, and yo! Oh, we missed it. Hold on, let me let me drag him out here a little bit. There you go. And three, two, one, yo! Oh my, Benny, Benny boy, you having problems? It's not the real Easter Bunny. It's a fruit wearing an Easter Bunny outfit. Okay, it's not real. And they're fruits. It's juices, you know. Uh, <laughs> I have just found something absolutely amazing and there's a mod that is going to revolutionize the way you look at weaponry. Let's just put it that way. But first, this thing! It is the automatic uh, themed Christmas weapon, which 
I don't know, it looks it got sprinkles on it or something. I don't quite know what it is. But let's, uh, I'm assuming it... Ooh, look, it shoots icy bullets. Let's make some applesauce. There we go. Get the applesauce. Okay, applesauce has been made. Now we can... Okay, we can move on to apple pie. Ladies and gentlemen, this is a normal, ordinary sized shotgun. It's not very big at all. But it's pretty devastating, right? This is the Christmas shotgun. <laughs> <laughs> Look at this thing! What the heck? This is, uh, I don't even... <laughs> I don't even know! What can you say about this? It better, it better have a, it better fire as large as it is. Let's see. Okay, three, two, one. Oh my, it's, it's not even a shotgun! It's a little baby thing. I'm so confused as to why this thing's called the shotgun and why it's so freaking massive i did this is not even look it's not even scaled like from by me it just this is how it spawns <laughs> i mean it's freaking amazing it's so weird uh, i've never seen a banana santa before but now i have i was gonna give him a new weapon but we have another gigantic weapon that cannot be held it's called the uh, candy scythe. Is that what it's called? The candy scythe? Seasonal scythe. It's huge, right? Now, I think we can probably re like scale it down, which will make it be able to be used probably. Not flatten it like, a, like that. Like, <laughs> what the heck happened? What's happening? Okay, it's not scaling quite the way that I wanted it to, but that's okay. And there we go. Now, can you wield it now? It's, it's it's a lot smaller. Probably can't even wield it yet, can you? Because it's still too big. Let's see. Can you pick it up? Yeah, he can. He totally can. And he's using it like a, I guess, a rocket launcher backpack, which is fine. Uh, we need to definitely have him like rehold it. Try to rehold it here, like this, and then you grab it. There we go. <laughs> Yeah, yum. There we go. Make some pear juice. What? What? Can you have pears at Christmas time? For any reason? Is there such a thing as pickled pears? I, I can't imagine. That's got to be gross. Why did it even pop into my mind just now? Look, it's covered in pear juices. Now, everyone knows corn, right? And corn can be made into popcorn in many different ways: igniting, flamethrowers, you know, fire, things like that. But can it be done with radiation? Well, there's a radiation gun. This thing that looks like a really interesting, like, fairy staff. Dude, did that squeak? <laughs> a squeaky staff. Uh, and I better be able to actually... Dude, wait, what the heck? It's, it's not even... You can't even fire it? Is it not... Why would you... Why would you call this a gun when it's literally just a squeaky staff? I'm so absolutely devastated right now. I don't even know where to begin. Again, again, we have a giant thing. <laughs> uh, it squeaks too. Uh, it is a gigantic sniper white rifle looking thing. And whoa, but this actually fires at like the of the, what you would expect it to. Let's see how many watermelons this can go through in an apple. So can it go through three, three of these at the same time? Let's see. Oh, hey, Bear, I almost didn't make it through this last one. But he did make it through three of them, which is pretty, pretty impressive for a big squeaky gun. Let's just put it that way. This thing is huge. It, it, I don't know what to think of any of these weapons. <laughs> now, I have two more things, and it should be pretty good. This, I'm hoping I saved the best for last. This is the Avalauncher, and I'm really excited about it, and I really hope that it is everything that I want it to be, because I'm a little disappointed in some of these weapons. But here we go, in three, two, one. No! What is it? Dude, are you serious? Are they broken or what? It's clearly some kind of, like, Automatic weapon. I thought it was gonna shoot out some kind of like giant white burst or something That is so absolutely disappointing. I cannot believe this right now. Now. There is one more. There's one more thing 
And I have hopes that maybe it, where is it? That it'll be good. Is it in here? No, it's gotta, I don't know. I don't know where it is. It's gotta be in here somewhere. Let's see if we can find it in here. Do, can we search for it? I don't know where it is. I found it, but it's not this, but there is a snowman. It's actually what it can roll, can get torn apart. <laughs> it's actually a snowball. Here it is. Three, two, one. Oh, that is the world's most devastating snowball. Here it comes, going down. Yeah, I like it a lot. Guys, let me know which of these things in today's video was your favorite because I don't know. I don't know. Probably mine was probably the shotgun just because of the simple like look of it and the effect that it carried <laughs> when it popped out. Ah, uh, I enjoyed this. Hopefully you did too. All right, there's more because there's a lot more mods. Maybe we'll do another one tomorrow.